the Gemlogis Azure Gem Tester distinguishes diamond from simulant. It is the ideal tool for industry users who deal mostly with gemstones. It comes with a compact carry pouch, metal stone rest and lanyard. Here's how to operate the Gemlogis Azure. To insert batteries, press the metal button to release battery compartment and pull away from the main unit. Insert three AAA batteries into the battery compartment in the correct position as indicated. To remove oxidation after long periods of storage, remove the protective cap. Gently clean the probe tip with a piece of paper. Or in a back and forth motion along the metal stone rest provided. Now turn on the tester by pressing the on-off button once. Allow approximately 10 seconds for the initial warm-up process, during which a green light will flash continuously in the result window. Once the green light stops flashing, the device is ready to use. To perform a test, hold a mounted piece of jewellery in one hand and the tester in the other. Point the probe tip against a facet of the gemstone. Press quickly and firmly and avoid touching the setting to establish a reading. For best result, make sure the tip is perpendicular to the stone. For testing loose gemstones, place the stone on the supplied metal stone rest. Secure it with one hand while holding the tester in the other. To read a test result, the red light indicates simulant, green light indicates diamond or moissanite is detected. If the probe tip comes in contact with metal, it will trigger a continuous beep. The Gemlogis Azure also communicates with Gemlogis Pistachio referential meter via infrared for further analysis of various simulants. For more information, please visit our website at www.gemlogis.com.